A girl named Leah was afraid to go to bed. Every time her mother read her a fairy tale before going to bed, kissed her on the forehead, and assured her that there was no one in her room. But she knew there was. She saw it. The fingers, black, long, dead fingers emerged from under the bed, out of the closet, and sometimes from behind the door. And she could hear someone's heavy breathing behind it. And so, as usual, Mom read her a fairy tale, said good night, and turned off the light. And at night, Leah was awakened by a squeaky sound. Someone was shuffling and making noise in her dark room. She opened her eyes and looked into the darkness. There were ten scary long fingers sticking out of the door, black, dead, and thin. They swished and moved slowly up and down, and there was someone behind the door. It stood there, breathing heavily. At first, Leah could not even move because of the horror that embraced her whole body. But then, when the door started to open slowly, she screamed loudly, closing her eyes. Mom came almost immediately and hugged her. Her gentle hands stroked and calmed Leah, while she kept crying and sobbing. Then she heard Mom's voice from her parents' room. Leah, honey, what's wrong? If Mom was in her bedroom all this time, then who stroked her head so gently? 